Hello YouTube, this is your boy Devin the Geek, and I am here to show you how to get your ICO plugin for your Photoshop. And what this does is it allows you to create an image in Photoshop and export it as an icon so you can swap your icon here for a different icon. And I will um, change my icon here to my Photoshop with a logo I already pre-made. Um, inside Photoshop but first we're gonna go and get our ICO um, plug-in and we're gonna to go to telegraphics um, dot com right here I'm gonna have the I'm gonna have the um the, oh, what's the word um, link I'm trying I was about to say something else sorry I'm gonna have the link inside um, my descriptions so yeah you come it's not a virus I don't think it's a virus I won't be talking if it was a virus on here but um, you come down here and you get the one that you want. I already have it, so I'm not going to download it. You get the version that you need for your computer. So close your browser. Open up the um, folder once you download it. And you're going to get this. It's going to say ICO format. Now what you're going to want to do is come over here to your Photoshop. Right click it. Go down to open file location. And now you're going to find the folder that says plugins. File, file, uh, find the folder that says file formats. And now what you're going to want to do is drag the ICO format right into here. See, so I already have it in here, so I'm going to replace it. Continue. Let it does this. I mean, do this. Right now, I'm just replacing it with the one I got right here. Let me refresh it just in case. Okay. Now that we got that out the way, I'm going to open up Photoshop. Let it open up real quick. Okay. I'm just opening up a previous one I already made here inside Photoshop. First, I'm going to have to resize it. Um, let me crop it. Oh, no, let me resize it first. Just resizing it. Let me redo it over. Now let's crop it. Zoom it in here just to make sure I got everything. Oops, my bad. Let's just open up another.
Okay, there it is right there. See what it is? See what the problem was is the icon on this um, one over here was a little bit too big. And the ICO file won't let you save or it won't show up because it's a little bit too big. You see it does, it's not there anymore because it's a little bit too big. And you got to make sure it's the right resolutions, like 52 by 52. So we're going to save this ICO format. Um, we're going to save it as ICO, Windows ICO, and we're going to save it to our desktop. Okay. And here it is right there. Now we're going to change this icon on my Photoshop program right here. Go down to properties. Go over to, wait a minute, go over to um, shortcuts, go down to change icon, go down to browse, go to desktop, and let's find, here it is, and apply, okay, and there we go. Now my um let me close Photoshop to show you that it works. Here it is right here, my um the one that I made. So let me click it. And there it is, it's opening up my Photoshop with the same icon right here. Oops. Yeah, see? Just change the icon with the ICO plugin right here. So I hope this was helpful. This has been your guy Davin the Geek. Um, rate, comment, and subscribe. See ya. I'm out.